Greetings mortals, I am the Fallen Shogun and welcome to another glorious day on Colony Survival! Not Colony Simulator, not Colony Colony Colony, it's Colony Survival! See, I occasionally read what the hell I'm playing, not all the time, just sometimes. But yeah, we have a lot of berry bushes, we have survival in the air, we need to go mining at some point, and we have beds and stuff. But yeah, what we need right now is epicosity. Which is actually a thing, you know. But either way, we have a lot of berry bushes. We don't have good food being made, but we do have food being made. So maybe some kind of bakery is the future. Not the complete future, just a future. Like, the complete future would be some kind of fishery, but we don't have access to fishing. Because apparently fish are wily, devious sods in this world. Anyway, how do I mine for fish? Who the hell knows? No one's ever told me. I ask in all the MMOs how I mine for fish, they never ever tell me. Okay, we found the ground. So this is what the dirt looks like at the bottom. So I've been told there are ores. The magical Book of Doom tells me there are ore here. Uh -huh. Just the sunlight coming down here, I like it. So yeah, what we need is some ore. Let's have a look at uh, one yeah. miner. Okay. Can I just have it mining stone? I'm pretty sure I can just have it just mining stone. Is that the same metal? Yeah, it is. Okay, so we're going to have a random stone miner just on the ground in general. We'll see how that works out. Oh, there we go, we need this as well. But yeah, what we need is more metal. Oh, coal, we need that as well. We need coal, we need metal. We definitely need coal for more things, we need metal for exciting things, and of course we need things for things. Things, things. Let me put one down here and see if that actually works. So yeah, we need a lot more miners for the future. Of course, we will, have, we will make this place better, but for now, it has to do. I mean, we're not really looking for excellence here. We're just looking for a place which works. I mean, my God, I literally just dug straight down. Never dig straight down. Well, I actually did stairs. Digging straight down is literally digging straight down. I even nerd pulled the archers. You don't want to nerd pull the archers. So we have three guys on the berry, one guy on there. Not really doing much, is he? Look at him. Look at his empty vacant eyes. Anyway, let's get another archer. Or whatever. Four job miners are missing picks. Oh my god, fine. What do we need for pick? We need to iron ingots. Oh my god, do I have to mine my own ingots? Actually, I should have some ingots. Yeah, I do. Excellent. Two pickaxes. There we go. There we go. Go mining, you horrible, ugly bugger. Down to 52 food. We should be okay 30 food-wise. We'll have to see. We might have just shot ourselves in the foot doing this, but we'll have to see, to see, to see, to see, to see. Okay, so we'll to see. Whatever we'll see, we'll see. Well, yeah, we should be okay. We have food coming in. Where's he going? We have some food coming in, we need more food coming in. So food is still a minor issue. In fact, for now, we'll do something a bit drastic. We're going to put a defensive wall around everything for now until I'm able to expand outwards. I mean, it's not going to look good, but you know, whatever. What we need is the undead hordes to stay the hell out of my place. And right now, my place is epic and brimming with life, kind of. Okay, that's the also there. We'll have like a doorway over here, solid. So as you can see, we've now sealed our area in, so I don't have to lock the door. Which is a thing I don't really want to do, I don't want to lock the door. What I am 
want to do is move that guy's little defensive thing to here. There we go. So we're going to have... Is this archer going to be over here? Can we move that archer from there to there? I'd like to think I can move him from there to there. We'll soon find out when he just becomes a bloody miner. Yep, he's become a miner. Okay, we're going to go in there. Wait, 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 wait. Yep, he's becoming a miner. Okay, we're going to cancel the jobs. We're going to cancel that job. Cancel that job. Cancel that job. We only need one guy mining down here right now. God is missing the bow. Really? He took the bow. There we go. Okay, we have coal being grabbed. Excellent. So now we can just go back to this. There, there. Wait, does that count? And uh, there. Yeah, I guess it counts. Okay, so we're slowly get a load of miners down here. What we need. But either way, what we need is people doing stuff. And they're getting there. I'm talking a lot because I'm trying to get this place looking nice-ish. And again, that requires us having actual troops. So he's going to be guarding that area. We're going to have a guy over here guarding this area. I might even actually put it down to actually have a kill count. A survivor count. Yeah, not a kill count. A death count. But I don't know. I think we'll be okay. We have 188 arrows. Our food is going up. Just. Didn't I have a load of arrows on me? Where'd they go? Did I just throw away 200 arrows at some point? Maybe I did. Who knew? <clears throat> Either way, the basics of our city is vaguely okay, vaguely okay. And of course we will slowly expand it to what we need, and when we need it. But we do of course need some more arrows. What are arrows may get made out of? Iron and planks, okay. So we actually need some iron being dug down there, that's fine, we'll remember that. 73 food, not the most food, but it is still food. We're also getting a surplus of food rather than a net loss of food. That's perfect. Did you grab any coal? He did. Excellent. How do I make these? Planks. Of course you do. There we go. Get back in there. So you just start setting up actual orders, set up uh, some kind of furnace system. And we can slowly keep expanding. Like I say, it's not the best. But the war against a little sodge will never be denied. There we go. I don't know, it's getting dark. Getting very dark. So what we'll do is we'll hide, hope, Pray and then murder a lot of the little sods. We actually need to start getting some forests down too. But yeah, I'm no longer sealing up the front. If we lose, we lose. No longer cheating mechanics. It looks to me like we're safe for now. Oh, here we go. You're gonna kill him? I'm gonna call you Bjorn Bjornson. Kill him, Bjorn Bjornson. God, that's actually a fair few, isn't there? One. Luckily, there's not too many at once. We should be fine. The more colonists you have, the more your survival is in doomja. Doomja. As you can see, he's only able to fire like one hour every now and then. And they're starting to appear. Luckily, there's luckily there's small amounts of them, but yeah, they are starting to appear. This guy sneaking around over here. Come on, Bjorn. Come on, Bjorn. Come on, yeah. Well done, Bjorn. Like I said, there isn't that many animations yet, the game. I keep saying early access. I only checked the name in between this recording and the last one. But either way, I will see you in the morning. Let's do this. And we're back to morning, vaguely. I have briefly started work on some kind of roof for my barrack thing. It doesn't look the best. I mean, yeah, it's not going to look the best. I might move that block there. It's just a simple uh, grassy roof exterior. 
that's what it needs to be for now. And we'll see how things go. But yeah, up till now, we have been quite happy, quite safe. But I'm going to keep on pushing expansion, pushing production, and hoping like hell we do something vaguely okay. Which may not be a thing, I have to see. Berries are coming in. We may have to do something about the wheat farm. I don't think I need it anymore. Yeah, we'll leave it for now. We'll see how it does. We also have a miner down below gathering coal, I still think. Motion blur when you go up and down is a bit annoying. There we go. He's grabbing. Grabbing. He's, he's grabbing. Which is gathering, grabbing. He's grabbing coal. Grabbing. This is why there was only ever one Shakespeare. No one will ever start saying grabbing. Anyway, let's carry on. Onwards, upwards, outwards, and over there. What we need to do now is keep on going. Dirt, straw, log temperate. Excellent. Okay, so what we need to do, carry on expanding. Put these guys back into here and see what we can do. Keep saying that. Because again, we are trying to make this place nice. I need to move you at some point, don't I? Or I just need to right click anywhere with it. I see, don't have to click on it. Okay. I have lived, I have learned it. Over here. But yeah, we need a lot more guys. Let's get some more banners. No, wrong thing. What have we got? Flax, berry farmer, wheat farmer, forester. There we go. What we're going to do is obviously keep expanding these. The more berry farmers we have, the better. Of course, right now it's not going to help us too much. But yeah, we need huge amounts more food to come into the system. I'm not entirely certain how well we're doing that way. Either way, we're getting there. We're getting there. Because again, you know. So let's go this way. So we need to keep expanding, growing the place. And making what looks to me like an epic city of awesome ferocitude. That's right, ferocitude is now a word. I don't know. Gotta be here then. I'm a moron. Let's put the exact same damn things back. There we go. Ah, stop it. Bad shogun. Over here we can start having... I don't know, an open barracks? To be fair, what you really kind of need is being to here, there, like that. But. And like Minecraft, it stays up, which is awesome. You have this. How many was it across? Seven? One, two, three, four, five, yes, yeah, seven. One, two, three, four, five, okay. Okay, we now have the beginning of the blacksmiths. Not going to look the best, but we don't need it to be the best. We need it to be serviceable and excellent. The blacksmith, of course, will be where I'm going to forge all my metals and make all my tools of war. Let's get another colonist. Oh, I need another bed. Okay, we just put some beds down. Where's the beds? So yeah, we're gonna get some more colonists because we seem to be doing okay food-wise. Done. Are you gonna be a farmer or a berry miner? Berry miner. He's a farmer. I lied. Okay, we're gonna go down here, cancel the um, miners for now. Mm. 
We're going to cancel all the miners for now. Actually, no, we're not. We're going to keep that guy in mind. I'm pretty sure he did us. Yeah, the last guy stole my pickaxes. So, yeah, we're going to leave you in. Everyone else is going to become farmers and archers for now. Because right now, we need all the berries we can get. You also need to make bread, which means we need coal. Which means we need... What is this? Oven? Do you have an oven? We have an oven. This is an oven. Infinite bread. So we do need another colonist. Someone just buzz me. This time of morning? Yeah, that's right. It's in the morning for me. Okay, that's done. So we're going to grab a load more people to do the burying. And then we can get someone over there. Minus two. What's left? Oh, there's another orchard thing over there. Yes. Then hopefully we can get someone working on the bread, expand the food, and then slowly start expanding everything else. But again! It's not like we have a choice here. We have a war to fight. And wars take huge hordes of loyal infantry, pounding the streets, murdering my enemies, and going over there to... I don't know. I don't know what you're doing. Yeah, we seem to be okay. Okay, good. We're low on the food, but we are still expanding the food. We don't have an issue where there's no food coming in, which is amazingly good. So over here we need to... Let's see. So yeah, one thing this game needs if you just build a city yourself is some kind of template, I'd like to say. A bit like Stone Off, you can make a template and just drop it in. But I also would like it that, you know, there'd be different types of stuff. But you need it to not look all the same. That's the problem which most building games fall in the very beginning, because they're early access, everything looks very samey. Which is a problem. Because no one wants to build the same 400 houses looking exactly the same. You need variety. That's why mod packs on Minecraft are so popular these days. But yeah. There's plenty of arrows. We may be low on food tomorrow. We'll have to see. In fact, I can probably do this. Can I? Can I just make bread? Can I not make bread? Got iron ore. Can I not make bread myself? Need it for bed, byproducts of wheat farming. Of course, for a grindstone, turns into flour. We need a grindstone. Ugh. Oh, good, we're about to starve to death. <laughs> Excellent. So what we need right now is... I've screwed up, haven't I? Yeah, I screwed up. Okay, I'll see you in the morning if you still live. This may be a quick episode otherwise. Oh my god, it's daytime and we're at 0.6 food. People are going to die. So yeah, I have a grindstone now. I have a few more torches. But yeah, we have a food deficit by a lot. People are going to die in a second. And it's my fault because I'm incompetent. So, yeah, hopefully they do something about it, but we'll have to see. Come on, gather some berries, throw them in the thing. Please throw some food into the chest. So we have the wheat farmer. Oh, God, five food. So we have a wheat farmer, we now need a grinder and a baker. So, yeah, we still need a lot more people, but... Yeah, we are now are on the way of actually not starving to death. Although well, that was bloody close. Oh my god. Never do what I just did, which is everything stupid. Yeah. Come on, get it, got it. But yeah, we're getting food. We have food. And we'll soon be able to start making bread, and then all the good things happen. Also, if I press G, I can apparently light myself up. See? I occasionally read the information in between missions of going out there and doing stuff. So yeah, I occasionally learn. Not always. It, 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 it's a rare occurrence, but I learn. Okay, so what we need here is more bricks. 
Alright, again, we need to be hit. There we go. Perfect Amundo! Like I say, a lot of other people probably have been cutting up massive chunks of what they're doing. I like trying to keep it as natural as possible. So you guys get to figure it. Of course, like I say, there's obviously going to be bloody cuts here and there, otherwise, that will go insane. And so will you, in all probability. Okay, do this. Do that. There we go. Thank you, now, but I cannot aim. How can I not aim? It's a square. It's very obvious what I'm doing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There. Okay, excellent. So we're slowly expanding outside of the defensive fortress, as you can tell, but again, it's fine for now. But we do need more people. I need a grinder and a baker. Which means, yeah, we do need the resources available. These little 7x7 seven seven places are becoming the norm. This is what my city is going to be. Little 7x7 seven seven whatchamacallums. They're not houses, they are... Well, they're crap, basically, but I have them. Is that noise or the torches? It is, we have too many torches, the noise is insane. Is there any other kind of light I can use? Mint. It's not counterfeiting if the king says it's okay. I'm glad I know this. Red planks, ooh. A abode. Dirt for rich people. Shop. Buying only no selling. Mate, so I can actually put down rich people houses? I'll have to have a look at that, but yeah, we need our food up. Our defences are okay, but we are getting towards the stage where we're getting to the danger zone. Because I was actually out here last night with my bow myself helping this guy out because there was slightly too many. And this is the easy setting, so yeah. We need to get enough food for the next load of guys and then we should be fine. But again, we are expanding outwards. I put a farmer, I need to expand my city, so issues, issues, issues. And again, this isn't the best looking place because we've not done much with it. I can actually go over here and actually have a see they'll be here then. Drop it! That'd be there. That'd be uh, there. Yes. Okay, one, two, three. I'm out of them. Three. I cannot do this. Four, five, six, seven. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five. As you can see, we're expanding for more barracks for the people. They may become single houses later on. Who the hell knows? We may do it. We may not. All we need to do now is make sure that the people are happy. There we go. And now we have another little dwelling. And I'm out of stone again. Eek. Okay, fine, whatever. See if I care. I do a little bit. It's my main problem. I care too much. But yeah, we need about three more colonists. So we're going to get enough food to put the bread combo down. Then we need another arch up on the wall. Which will be this defensive area here, actually. Let me have a look at this. Um... Oh, we don't have it. Hey, I took away the workbench because the guys are just making random axes. If the food is now back in the yellow rather than the red. That is a perfect omundo. Otherwise, what the hell's the point of anything? Let's see. They're, they're walking oddly. The weird bendy arms. What are you doing? Why are you doing it? Tell me more. Tell me more. Ooh, there's actually some detail in this, look at that. 
I need to make me where you're looking though. Look at that. Ah, you walk for me. Okay, there's more details than I expect on that. I mean, the models are actually... It's like I've actually got 3D on them. See that? That actually looks 3D. Maybe this. Maybe that. Oh, that's interesting. It's not actually 3D. Look at it. It's all it's inset. Very odd. It's very odd from the corners. It looks detailed as hell, though. Yeah. Either way, I have been the Fallen Shogun. I think. How long has it been? How many nights has it been? Where am I? You keep expanding and growing. We actually do have this in the back. We do have a good system of stuff and things. Building a lovely hamlet of necropolis. We're not a city yet. We need more people. We don't even have... We have what? Eight people? Yeah, we have eight people. It's not exactly a city, is it? It's a hamlet at best. At exceedingly best. Mr. Kipling. God, God he's got a lot of coal. Um, we have to talk to him about that. Bit too much coal. Hundred coal. Oof. Okay, we have to go down there. Cancel him. Or well, if we cancel him, we'll put another guy up. Yeah, we can do that. Okay, we'll find another person. Then we can cancel this miner. And there we go, we now have a combo up top of grinding and making the bread. Although I'm going to have to help out at night again. Let's get my bow. Either way. Oof. How are we doing? I have been the Fallen Shogun. This has been... God, look at this. Colony Survival. If you enjoyed as always, like, comment, share, and subscribe. If you comment or reply, if you like the series, will count for longer. And of course, if you subscribe, you do become part of the Fallen. You know new videos and series come out. And at the end of the last battle, I will see you in Valhalla. These guys won't. These guys will be dead. Oh. I don't have any arrows. Chows for nows, people. Bye-bye. Finally, some bloody arrows.